Tens of thousands of protesters paralyzed central Hong Kong on Wednesday, blocking major roads in a defiant show of strength against government plans to allow extraditions to China. Black-clad demonstrators, most of them young people and students, surrounded government offices, bringing traffic to a standstill as they called on authorities to scrap the Beijing-backed plan. Rows of riot police were far outnumbered by protesters, many of whom wore face masks, helmets or googles, just hours ahead of a scheduled debate in the city's legislature. By late morning, with crowds continuing to swell, officials in the Legislative Council said they would delay the second reading of the bill to a later date. In scenes echoing the Occupy movement in 2014 that shut down swaths of the city for months, people flooded major roads and junctions in the heart of the city, dragging barricades onto highways and tying them together, while some plucked loose bricks from pavements. Police used water cannons and pepper spray on protesters outside the building and held up signs warning demonstrators they were prepared to use force. More than a million people turned out to voice their objections to the proposed law, which will allow Hong Kong to send suspects to other jurisdictions around the world, including China.